Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life. Uh, for me, this has actually been a little while. Uh, when I said I was going to go off and figure out what I needed to do to tame a parasaur, uh, then I had my mom come up and visit for the weekend because my little sister graduated. Um, it was a really fun weekend, but I've been away from the game for a little while. When I came back, I decided I didn't want to come back in the shape I was in. We had uh, our base, which is out in that direction, sort of. Uh, we had that, uh, there's two giant crocodiles there. So I did build things up a bit, but uh, I kind of got chased off and I realized rather than going back to that same spot and trying to fight your way back into your stuff, it's better to set up a couple of bases. So with that in mind, uh, you recognize this spot. This is where we spawned at the very start of the game. I fought two megalodons right in that bay. Um, a turtle, almost, I think he killed me just up there, but I have built us a little house. Oh, that's not how I do that. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, I built us a little hut. Yeah, down here I, I set up our very first ever campfire. I think I might have died to a spitter. Um, our other base, that house I had on the beach, is way up around this way. And the sort of oasis we were at earlier is back in there. Uh, but this little base, I realized with those two giant crops, those thatch houses can get smashed. They were wrecking my house. Uh, so I rebuilt it, I think, the last time I was back there. But they will just smash through your stuff. So I went, collected a ton of wood, and built us a little wooden hut here. Uh, and you know what? I can't, re can't even remember. It's been a little while. But yeah, it's much sturdier. I can't remember if I upgraded the hut in the oasis. And if I did, if you guys saw that. And then I got a bunch of storage. We got five boxes here, got a little campfire, obviously, but, uh, yeah, lots of good stuff, berries and whatnot there. Uh, we've got extra tools, extra am- uh, not am- we got extra tools, we've also got, uh, armor, kind of like the clothing and stuff, and then I've got stone and brick and stuff like that, but I am not done. I have been grinding. I have been doing some work! Uh, I've been trying to take care of business, uh, watching other people's, uh, let's plays. And I was like, you guys tame Triceratops and stuff? Like, I didn't have, you know, I haven't had much of anything that could actually even deal with a Triceratops. So I'm going to show you up here. This is like a pride rock type geological formation. Very cool. We're on sort of the northeast. If you peek at your map, uh, I think, uh, you see there's sort of three things of land sticking out. There's an island in the top right. Well, going kind of from the left of that island, that little nipple that sticks out, if I'm not mistaken, I believe that is uh, this rock, and that little lake right there is right along that, see that big indentation on the far side of that rock just before the jungle? I think that's the lake, and then even beyond that, the circle in the very middle, I think that's our oasis, but uh, I just want to show you, it is hot up here, uh, not crazy hot, but I've built another hut. Uh, this one I have not geared up. It doesn't have a ton of stuff in those boxes, but it's got a campfire. It's got a door, and there is more than that. I We're still going to do what I promised we were going to do. We're still going to tame a parasaur, and I'm all but ready to do that. But uh, in one of the paths that leads back into that oasis, it was dark. It was the middle of the night. Uh, I was being chased by all kinds of crazy stuff. Like, it was a nightmare for a while there. Uh, and then I ended up coming across... Meho. Yeah! See? Uh, I named, uh, <laughs> I named, uh, her that because that is her favorite type of berry. This is a Fiomia. They're not that much fun to ride, uh, so I haven't bothered wasting the, uh, the hide on the saddle, but they're a hell of a workhorse, and I can get this pretty girl to come right with me by doing this. Uh, and so she will follow me. Uh, and we will go find ourselves a parasaur and name it after its favorite berry. So we'll bring, uh, we'll bring Mayho along. Just like a little cute, cute doggy. See him? Come on, boy. Good boy. Yeah. You're a good boy. My dogs are gonna get all excited now. Um, oh. Yeah, and I have more surprises for you guys. So, obviously, we're all geared up in full armor. We got a decent amount of food, but look what Unite the Clans has created. Yes, that is right. A bow and arrow, and I've used it to slay many things. I'm a powerful, dangerous hunter. Uh, but this, yes, is a uh, bow and arrow. Arrows are pretty cheap to craft. It's like two flint, two fiber, one wood, something like that. Uh, so, And I've actually got more arrows, I think, set up in one of these there boxes. 
No, obviously not that one. Um, oh yeah, do you guys know, if you've been playing, what do you use charcoal for? I'm imagining like black dye, but can you ever use it to like burn a torch or anything? Yeah, so here we go. Uh, oh man, I'm, I need to make some arrows. We'll take half of those. I've got obviously backups of bows, hatchets, picks. We've got slingshots, torches, all kinds of cool stuff uh, here. I just, I was tired of dying, trying to get back to where I was, and I thought, you know what, it can't hurt to have like a, a second base. Uh, and now we've got two other bases, which is great. Uh, the mayo berries, uh, I now remember, I don't even bother putting in there because those, ladies and gentlemen, belong to Mr. Mayho here. Now I can saddle him up, I can make him wander around. That's brand new, just added in uh, 2, 215, I think is the update. Two, I can't remember what the updates are numbered like. Make him passive, aggressive, not passive aggressive. Uh, you can access inventory, change his name, unclaim him, yeah right. And then you can use this one, disable following, but J makes him follow, and U makes him stay put. Anyway, I can't whistle that well. I could do that, I could do the J one. And there's a Y whistle too, but I don't know what it does. So I'm gonna give him some more mehos, and it also helps, the more that we give him of this, when we go find that parasaur, the readier we'll be. And I think the time has come to make a parasaur saddle, if I can remember where I keep my crappy come on gimme where do I keep all my leather hide my keyboard isn't working so well right right now uh, as as happens so we have 55 hide I can't remember if that's enough if not I'll go uh, get lost for a minute and we'll get what we need for a parasaur saddle there it is oh we need 80 okay so guys, I, uh, I'm gonna stash these here then, and I'll do a little hunting. I'm sorry, I, th or I thought I had everything we needed. So I'll do a little hunting, uh, I'll bring home, tw what, 25 more hide, we'll craft a Parasaur saddle, and then, uh, I did do a little recon, I spotted a couple of them one way up that way, and I imagine if we head back to the Oasis, it was starting to get repopulated with Parasaurs. So yeah, let me do my thing, and, um, I'm gonna come back uh, to you geeks when I am, like, geared up and ready to go. Oh. Uh, I haven't used the term, guys, uh, when it comes to dinosaurs, and uh, if a few of you clever ones might know where it comes from, but this is what you might call charismatic megafauna. We got double brontos, we got a f-ton of triceratops, or we got spitters, who by the way, don't hit the triceratops, that's right. Uh, I see stegos, oh, get out of the way, Mayho! There we go. Yeah, get him. She a good girl, ain't she? But yeah, this is a cool amount of, uh, there's some hide for us. Yeah, we're gearing up already. Where's that other one I done killed? Where are you, where are you going to? That's all right, probably wouldn't give me much hide. Stupid, it's just over here. There we go. Yeah, look at, look at, these are like, these are the dinosaurs that you grew up going like, look at those three. That's like a triumvirate with a T-Rex. Those are the ones we love, like the raptor. Nobody really cared that much about the raptor until Jurassic Park, as I remember it. Hi, pretty. Yeah, you're dead. Oh, I should have got out of the way better. Oh, I don't have another spear. Whoa, get, stay away from that tail. He's going to kill my guy. Don't kill Mayho. Triceratops, ba oh, oh, Stego bastard, you're gonna kill Mayho. Stop swinging. Oh, Mayho, get, get, Jay. Come here, buddy. Oh, this is a tragedy. Oh, those Stegos, come on, guys. That was Mayho. Oh, you, yeah, I just lost my best friend. You son of a. Ugh. Maybe this, did the Stego hit me? Is that why Mayho went nuts? Or maybe he hit Mayho. I had him cycled to passive and attack what I attack, not attack what attacks me, I don't think. Dang! Dang, I'm glad I was talking to you guys and recording when that happened, but... Well... Good news is, he had like a hundred pounds of berries. Uh, and this man will give us potentially all the hide we need. This beast. Oh, 
poor Mayo, baby. She was such a smart girl. Like a little puppy. Oh. Why do I need all this? Get that freaking death tail away from me, you monster. They're dangerous. You can't, they don't play nice. Heck, 